but we've been dealing with it down south. But notice that a lot more northerly locations are being added into the pot this week, including the Dakotas, the upper Midwest, the Ohio Valley. We're going to be sweating it out across the country. So this is some persistent extreme heat. It kicked off yesterday. 100 degrees in Midland, which is just a continuation. I mean, they've had over 40 days in a row in West Texas of triple digit heat. But look at the alerts for today. So we have a heat advisory that's being triggered across Montana. Yes, it's going that far north. Uh, so some areas that might not have air conditioning are going to have to face this extreme heat. Now down in the south where, I mean, everybody's got AC in Florida, it's just been a long stretch. I mean, our average afternoon highs in Miami tend to be in the upper 80s. We've been clocking out in the 90s, feeling like the triple digits because of the humidity in place. So we have another extreme excessive heat warning in effect for Miami today. So this has all been really developed by some very hot conditions across Florida, of course, but the southwest, it's been a ridge of high pressure that's been very persistent. It's been parked, and now we're going to see that ridge of high pressure kind of wiggle farther out towards the east and grow. And so that's why we're adding people to this. Uh, today, we're expecting triple digits as far north as Billings, Montana. That heat moves over to the Dakotas for tomorrow. So Rapid City is looking at 96, 97 degrees in Minneapolis. So a lot of these northerly cities like Green Bay hitting the 90s. It's going to be a long stretch. 90 degrees expected on Wednesday. Get this, Green Bay by end of week could be facing triple digit heat. Now for big northeast cities where we have to worry about the whole urban heat environment, we're expecting a heat wave in New York. Jason, that's three days in a row of 90 degree heat or hotter. The tough thing is at night we don't cool down. And so New York City has to look at this first heat wave of the summer. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way. So make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.